Hello guys uh, and girls, everybody, people. Uh, let's make this gender in specific. Just wanted to show you my, uh, I finally completed it. I worked very hard on this. Um, I've been very blessed and I've been able to build my dream setup and I wanted to go through what that entails uh, equipment wise um, and other things. Cause I have art in this room and I have a bunch of other things. So um, let's go st start around. I, I, I got this secret lab TV chair uh, with the orange coloring and I really like that. So we match the curtains, as you can see, which also provide as some, sub, some uh, reverberation control and sound control. And behind that, we have sound absorbing foam. So uh, this is covered on both walls. Uh, we have a nice window over there. So we did some sound acoustics in here and that's really keeps the echo down. We run carpet on the floor um, to also help with that. So we got the secret lab. Then we got a few paintings that I purchased on uh, eBay. These are my monsters, nails and tooth, I call them. They watch over me while I work. I'm a software developer and a gamer, as you can see. Um, so I spent a lot of time in this room working or playing uh, and so it was very nice to get some things done with it that I really want now moving on let's talk about the audio I wanted the perfect audio setup I am a bit of a gamer and I am a bit of an audiophile so um, I did a lot of research and uh, came across uh, Jay he's a youtuber and he has a uh, recommendation and a review on this, which is the Wilson Wilson Tin R8. It's a Chinese at made amp, a tube amp, as you can see. It uses uh, KT88s I got in there. Um, you know, Golden Lions, they sometimes call them. And so that's the amplifier. It adds a little bit of warmth to it. Uh, I really like the sound. I couldn't be happier. It's not for sale. <laughs> I'm keeping it. Um, and I was very happy with his review. He has a lot more likes than I do, a lot more followers, and he deserves it. He makes good videos. Um, so go check out his channel. I'm a subscriber, and he's got thousands of subscribers. Anyways, the next thing that we got below the Wilsonton is we got the Caviar Tube hybrid amp. You can buy this off of Mass Drop. You can see it here. And it has the balanced headphone output. Uh, I also have a Gustard. I think it's an H15, I think they call it, uh, DAC. So I run optical from my computers to this. And this converts my computers into an analog signal, which is picked up by this preamp and amplifier. Um, it's an integrated amp and that will play music off of these two which I consider my ultimate computer speakers I couldn't be more happy with them they're the CAF LS 50s of course uh, they have an aluminum driver here uh, and a Q design which is very beautiful I love the color too the red color the gray color uh, it was one of the few newer speakers I buy. I mostly use more vintage gear because of the value savings. Um, but this one, this one I really wanted because of its uh, coaxial design. Moving on, we've got a, uh, as you can see, one of the sensors for the VR. It's backwards. Um, we got another one over here. Uh, we do have VR, as you can see up above here. We got the Gus Fink painting. Great artist, check him out, Gus Fink. Um, highly recommend him. He, he, he makes some great art, and I was fell in love with this, put the frame on it, bought it from him. Very happy. Uh, and then I got my uh, Oculus. That's the first generation Oculus Rift, I think they call it. 
I would not buy that again. Now that Facebook owns it, I would rather go with the HTC version. But, you know, it gets the job done and it is a pretty good uh, unit. I, I don't need to upgrade. Uh, when I use it, I enjoy it very much. Then we got the, I believe it's the Acer. Um, it is a 43 inch high definition screen, ultra high definition screen. It's got HDR, it's got 144 kilohertz gain, uh, kilohertz, so it can show 144 frames per second. It's, it, it, it's an incredible uh, purchase. It's the Swift. I'll have it down. I believe it's at Acer that makes it, but um, let me put the brand and everything down in the description. Uh, I really like it. I had a problem with my TV, my computer booting up and it wasn't showing immediately. Turns out it was an Nvidia driver that needed to be updated. So since then, everything seems to be much better. It's also kind of blinks off once in a while. Uh, maybe once a day, I notice. Um, I haven't had that happen since upgrading the NVIDIA drivers, so we'll keep an eye out for it. Above here, we got the uh, uh, a ultra high definition webcam for us to communicate on. The blue microphone, which is a very nice microphone for gaming. Uh, the only thing I want to do is get an arm up here. Got the Dell XPS 15 9570. Great machine, very light. Uh, I use it for mostly work. Uh, so I work on VMs and things. It's got a lot of memory and it does everything I really need it to. Okay, and then we got down here, the computer. That is the new AMDs, the Zen 5 9800, uh, the fastest one, for gaming at least. They're coming out with a Threadripper, which will probably beat it and everything else. It runs at a GTX 1080, a little older graphics card, a couple years old. But I don't need to upgrade it. It gives me great frames per second, so I'm keeping it. Probably will wait until the 4000 series comes out for the NVIDIA. My TV does support sync, so uh, that is always nice as well. And then up above, we got three sets of headphones. I've got a wireless pair of Sennheisers over here. Uh, they're closed back, um, so they keep the noise down naturally by themselves. Uh, then I have a pair of Sennheiser 200 series. I would buy a higher version of those, but I have the Oppo Ha um, planar speaker headphones. And those are the good ones. Um, they don't no longer make it. Oppo now makes phones only. They still support it, but they're great sounding, amazing headphones. Couldn't be happier playing it either out of the tube amp down there or the tube amp up there. Uh, it works great. I use uh, optical, like I said, to connect this DAC. I don't use surround sound because the only time I would ever want surround sound is the few times I have friends in here. Uh, and instead, I recommend using the headphone surround sound uh, if you can, uh, especially for gaming. I, I mean, it's just so accurate. You can even hear where people are coming from, where your enemy is coming. Uh, know that they're coming around the corner because you can hear their footsteps. Uh, and that's amazing. Um, it's so accurate and so easy to put placement on those headsets, especially with the Dolby Atmos headphones. So that is my entire office here. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope this came out good. Thank you. I think we covered everything very shortly.